Hand over here, and today I'm doing a Raid Meter tutorial. And so, what is Raid Meter? Is this cool desktop customization that actually makes you makes your computer look all like this and cool and all that. So, and this thing over here, uh, my mouse pointer is actually rotates. So that's kind of cool. This tells you all your stuff. This will update with your computer. And okay, so let's get into the tutorial. So now, where's Rain Media? So now, if you just go Google, actually, I'm just gonna put the, all the links that you need in the description. Oh my God, I am the worst spelling person ever. Okay, anyway, so this is Rain Meter, and uh, now while you're installing it, you may get a question if yours is a 32-bit or a 64-bit. So just click your start thing and go to properties and let's show you the properties of your computer and it will be shown 64-bit operating system so now you know that yours is a 64-bit if it is written 32-bit then yours is a 32-bit and all you have to do is the download the final or the beta the final sounds better so I'm just gonna get the final I guess I guess I don't know I <laughs> okay, but I've already downloaded this, so it'll open in your downloads folder wherever you have your downloads, and um, you can just run it, and then it will. You have this icon in your taskbar thingy. I just like use thingy so much, right? Now, right now, you won't have all of this, so don't be like, "Hey, I don't have all of this," because all the links are in this description. So you can download themes. So this I can download it, and uh, I'll be showing you how to install a few of them. But just download it from over here. I'll be showing you how to install this one. It's called Tech A. Looks pretty cool and all that. Then you have the Simply Nova theme. Download again, and uh, this is another site called Customize.org, and you get a lot of a lot of other Rainmaker skins over here. Oh, and the one which I'm going to be showing you is Technologic. I have that downloaded. And the last one is Space. So this is also quite a cool theme. But I won't be using all of these. You know, just I, I like my theme. But uh, you don't have to follow me. You can be creative. Do whatever you want. Okay. So let's just go into this folder which I created. And you may get into a raw zip so you may need winra or you can use 7 zip if it's a zip file anyway so just click extract here or extract files you'll get this and you can go into the folder on, until you see a thing like this which is the name with the r and the file type is a rms skin which is a rain meter skin so you just click it and then this will come and Green meter and all these themes. Um, a lot of people have downloaded this. I've downloaded my French control c computer. I was a birthday controller. I don't know why. My French computer, my computer, and I have not got a virus. So just hit install and it will install and it's done. Now, but some files do come. I just closed it. Some files do come, like, let me just do this. Extract here. Now some files may come like this without an RMS skin. I'm just gonna delete that. So now you can't just. Oh yeah, some of them may have a background, and you can apply it and all that. But I like this background. It looks pretty cool. Anyways, so now you can't actually use this. There will be no RMS skin. So what you have to do is um, go over here, right click and click exit. <laughs> I know it's kind of weird that we're just exiting the thingy but that's how you do it. Then navigate over to documents again. This is my doc which is a separate program. And he head over to rain meter then go to skins and then it will be over here. So 
just drag this right over here drag and drop people now close it and then just yeah I have it right on my thingy but if you can't find it just type it in you'll find it open it and then it's back so when you get it it should be like this so now let me just show you the theme first let me just minimize that I'm just gonna get my icons ready you know and if this may not work it's probably because you just need to go to and untick align auto arrange icons because then you will not be able to pull it out and drag it where you want so go to view and untick auto arrange icons so then you can just drag it freely if you want and place it wherever you want except just make sure that you can see it or if you don't want to see your icons just go to view and untick show desktop icons all your icons are gone but I just like my icons being there okay and I'm gonna keep this on the top a little bit now let's enter rain meter so aux again you have to install it if you have any problems just tell me now it may come wherever you want wherever it was but you just have to drag and drop it so it's as simple as that and it's already starting to look cool oh God. so this is simply nova and if you do install some of these they may already come preloaded so just go hover over it right click and click on load skin so now I have to go put that back <coughs> now you go I'm gonna get this bar horizontal this cool thingy bar vertical this thingy now just get all of these you can drag and drop it wherever you want if you just want to copy me you can I mean I have no problem but if you want to customize it your way you can now obviously you want to actually what you're not supposed to be in front of this display okay anyways if you go on this then you can also uninstall it or you can do hover on high okay wait okay so this is loaded in so when I do hover on hide it will become will just completely hide if you want to troll in if you want to fade in you may not notice that unless I put the transparency down okay transparency is basically if you put it it will look transparent yeah look you can that looks so cool so if you want that I'm just gonna leave it like that and fade out means it will go a little bit dark apparently let me just try that again Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna leave it and do nothing and it's a transparent it is zero. I'm not gonna mess with all of that. Let's on let's load system and USB. Now let's go to time and date. Oh wait. <laughs> I already did that. And weather when you have two files you can usually only load one. Now look, my weather is vertical and now my weather is horizontal. So you can only load one sometimes not always so now in space it's a combination of other programs if you want to just load everything on it will look cool like this and you can just drag and drop but I'm just gonna be using burn this thingy icons and this is actually cool like a dock except it's not dock so and in tech A I want the rotator and rotate oh god why did I do that so now select yeah, the rotator may come in the middle or at the side all you have to do is click on it and drag and if you just go over here you can hit snap to edges so that it snaps to other places like other icons and 
and if you want not to mess it up then you can make it undraggable undraggable is that even a word so now I can drag this but I can't drag that because I just went and set it to undraggable but I'm just gonna make it draggable and uh, you go technologic I'm gonna be using the second gig no I don't personally I don't like this now actually this clock setup wasn't exactly by me so the person who actually did show me how to do this clock I will actually put a video to him in the description and I remember everybody drag and drop and he probably may do a better job of explaining and if you want you can subscribe to him and that is basically how I do my desktop looks pretty cool right all this moving stuff I know it does not take too much RAM oh wait I forgot one thing which is also in technologic and if you want some halo stuff they have some halo stuff but let's not get into that okay so what was it RAM remember I'm just gonna place um, and yeah if you click RAM it will open all the stuff where is reader no then where is it oh god I just where is it one sec guys just finding for something you serious no way I don't know what happened oh god oopsie guys I and guys you probably may be thinking I'm a retard because it was right over here and that so there's the bin and you can make it to whatever customization you want you don't have to follow mine I'd suggest you be creative and all that if you want <laughs> and thank you guys all links for this ox Turkey, okay, simply no green uh, technologic and space will be in the description so if you and guys yes probably you windows 8 users were wondering how you figure that out I do not know but you can google it yes I'm pretty sure that there will be a lot of results in google so thank you guys and bye